Um, good afternoon. Thank you for the opportunity to pitch today. My name is Jessica Anderson, and I'm here with my business partner, Nicole Lorenzi, and we're the founders of Bucket. I thought of the idea for Bucket in March 2020 when we were all on lockdown because of the pandemic. I just grabbed 10 Amazon boxes off my doorstep when my phone dinged with the New York Times story that Jeff Bezos had just become the world's first personal trillionaire due to the lockdown and the fact that no one, including myself, was shopping in person. And I instantly felt sick about it. And I thought, how are these small retail businesses going to survive this? I wish there was an Amazon for small businesses. And then I thought, wait, why couldn't there be an Amazon for small businesses? And then I Googled what's the name of the smallest rainforest in the world as opposed to the largest, which is Amazon. And the answer is a tiny 25 acre rainforest in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia called Bucket. Well, I mean, technically it's pronounced Bukit, but we're American, so we call it Bucket. And we bought the domain and here we are. So the problem is that small local retailers have a difficult time competing against Amazon, Target, and Walmart and other multinational online chains. Consumer shopping habits have changed. More people are shopping online than ever before. Customers like me and Nicole, we're used to the convenience of having things delivered to our doorstep and we're not going back to exclusively shopping in person. So how does Bucket work? Customers can go on bucket.com either via their desktop or their mobile and search for local products by search bar. They can search by merchant, they can search by category. They can put multiple products from multiple merchants in their cart and just check out just like they would on Amazon. The difference is that instead of having to wait a couple of days for their order to arrive, we deliver the same day to the customer's doorstep. And that way we're fulfilling the customer's needs in a way that is both convenient and efficient. And we're also convenient to the merchants um, because our platform integrates with many existing platforms that the merchants are already using like Shopify, Revel, Clover. Our platform provides smart delivery. The customer chooses their delivery time. The platform determines the most efficient route for both pickups and deliveries. Our platform provides a unique customer experience because the customer is able to track their order and receive notifications at every step of the way. We don't use Uber or DoorDash drivers, but rather bucket employed drivers. We have full control over the delivery experience and are able to provide outstanding customer service as well. So as you can see the market for online shop is substantial and it's growing. So if the pandemic taught us anything, it strengthened the value of e-commerce for us with the convenient shopping and the quick del delivery of all things essential. So now Bucket is doing just that on a local level so we can help small businesses really have skin in the game. So the potential in Reno's market alone is significant. And according to Statista of the adult population in Reno Sparks who like to shop online, and prefer to shop local, that's over 52,000 people. So with an average sale of $86, a delivery fee of $11 per order, along with 11% transaction fee times 12 months, this equates to a 12.9 million SOM. And then our next step is really building the same business model in similar market cities, like Salt Lake City, Sacramento, or Tucson. So the combined population of the local regions, including Reno, would be a SAM of 68.8 million. For us, the master plan is really taking Bucket's local e-commerce solution nationwide to those 49.9 million US adults who prefer to shop locally online. This would result in a potential TAM value of 12.2 billion. And as I touched upon, Bucket's current revenue streams, we've broken it down into three buckets. The first being local consumer purchases, which results in an 11% fee collected from merchants on all sales made through the platform. And then the next is our small business solutions, which is what we offer by identifying the individual marketing needs of our retailers. And this averages a spend of $150 per merchant per month. And then finally, our delivery fees, which are an $11 flat fee per customer delivery order. So from a competitive view, there's nothing like Bucket in the online shopping space. The side-by-side -side comparisons of the most common e-commerce platforms largely lack the integrated technology and the customer service that Bucket provides. This entails a specific local online marketplace, same-day delivery, promoting local businesses, integrating with multiple POS options, 
the option for direct purchases on the platform, concierge service, local customer service, and a user-friendly merchant portal. I think it's also important that we point out the cost to the merchant and the customer for bucket service is less in comparison to the average cost among the three commonly used platforms that are shown here, Amazon, Etsy, and DoorDash. Our go-to-market strategy is that we're building our brand equity, increasing engagement, and we'll expand to new territories as soon as we prove ourselves in this market. We are constantly providing original blog content for our merchants regarding their businesses and their products. We send out email newsletters and we've expanded our social media reach across multiple platforms. We're doing awareness campaigns, press releases. We've been featured on radio and local news several times. Our team is also busy getting new merchants and developing business. In fact, we're super excited to announce that we just signed Pitbull, the singer. He has a local health and wellness company right here in Reno called 305 Life. And obviously, obviously having someone famous can help promote our site. It's really going to help um, get our name out there. And we're beyond excited about our success since the launch of our MVP and the milestones. So we're on track to onboard and maintain 100 or more active merchants. We're building awareness, trust, and authority in our local community. We're on target to achieve 4 to 6% market penetration. We forecast bucket delivery options in new cities. We're creating a drop shipping option to extend our reach. And we're excited to launch a mobile app for convenience. The last thing we're doing is developing a proprietary point of sale system. Because as we've been out there, we've learned that our retail partners are frustrated with their current national POS systems. So we have identified an opportunity for a local solution. So with respect to our team, I'm the founder and CEO. I've been in business you know, in the business world for over 22 years. I've owned and operated my own business for the last 12 years. Nicole's the co-founder and CMO. She has over 22 years of marketing experience. Frank Abrat, he has 28 years at UPS, has the logistics experience necessary to manage our fleet. And Brianna is a very talented creative who has met our photography needs and helped with our social media. We're also incredibly proud that we have over 30 retail partners join us on our platform. And this number continues to grow each month. So as you can see, we have some pretty popular local retailers that provide essential and non-essential items to our customers. You can find the most popular selling categories and products like poison games, pet supplies, home and kitchen products. You can get your laundry detergent, personal care items like toothpaste and shampoo, flowers, gifts, clothing, jewelry, coffee, client gifts. I mean, books, the list goes on. In the beginning, we had a cold call retailer to introduce Bucket's concept and establish these accounts. But at this point, retailers are contacting us to collaborate, like the account with Pitbull. They definitely see the value of offering online shopping and delivery to their loyal customers, but they're also enthusiastic to grow their business and reach new ones. We believe that $500,000 for 20% of our company is a very reasonable ask. With that $500,000, we are confident that we can meet all of our operational needs. And with the majority of those funds being used to market and advertise and increase the awareness of that bucket to the Reno Sparks region. Our financial outlook is good. We only need 4% market penetration um, to reach our goal by the fourth quarter of 2022. Our MVP was just completed at the end of March. In total, we've generated sales and merchant fees of $31,448 with an average spend per customer of $152.37. And that's just with word of mouth. We haven't done a big marketing push yet, so we expect those figures to substantially increase. We don't have any out of the ordinary costs. Our marketing budget needs to be you know, fairly high, but otherwise everything else is standard and we would not be overextended at all. So we found that locals love the convenience of Bucket, as you can see in these reviews. And honestly, the retailers just think it's a game changer for them. But what we did is we put a little video together so you can listen for yourselves from a few of our partners. I thought it was absolutely genius, especially with everything we've been through since the start of the pandemic. It's any way you can reach more customers with making them feel safe. We thought it was a great way, especially during 
you know, the pandemic um, to allow people to really have access to the products that we offer. I mean, you know, launching a 8,500 square foot toy store is a feat unto itself. And so they're going to really help accelerate that part of the process. The way Bucket is helping us is allowing us to be even more convenient to the local public here in town. They're offering a service that allows us to be competitive with the big stores that offer convenience such as same day delivery, second day delivery, and it's just so much easier for people to shop local. You can shop by category or by store, and it's something that is only for the Reno area. So thank you very much for letting us pitch today, and we're now ready for your questions. Thank you, and that is time.